So is Sui nothing but hype? We're going to talk about that in today's video. But first, for anyone that's looking for a great crypto indicator, which lets you know when's a good time to buy and sell crypto, also lets you know when there's a bearish and bullish momentum happening in any particular coin, I highly suggest you check out TradeAssist. It's a very useful tool to have in your back pocket. The link is going to be in my description down below. No more buying high, selling low. This is definitely very helpful, in my opinion, anyways. There's also going to be a link to Margex. For anyone that's a leverage trader, it requires no KYC. And then there's also going to be a link to my Patreon for anyone that's curious about what I'm buying, when I'm buying, and you can also find some exclusive content over there also. All right, but let's get into things. So to start things, I just want to take a look at the fear and greed index. Right now, we are in greed. And personally, I don't think we're going to leave greed for quite some time. Because if we take a look at the overall crypto market, what we see here is we are currently in this massive cup and handle situation right here. And this is normally a very, very bullish situation. I think that we're going to head up and things are going to get pretty intense. Of course, I can always be wrong, so make sure you do your own research. But this massive cup and handle that's formed on this weekly time frame, and then we also see this big bull flag that's formed right here also. So this is literally a cup and handle bull flag right down there. It's, my drawing's a little messy, but you guys understand what I'm saying, hopefully. But yeah, I think that the run is gonna continue to run and the market is gonna make people an insane amount of money. I mean, an insane amount of money. But getting back to the first point, is Sui just all hype and nothing but? Well. The thing is, I feel like some people don't understand what they're investing in because what you're investing in is crypto, right? And crypto is driven by hype, driven by narrative. At least it is right now. So does it really matter whether or not SWE is all hype? No, it doesn't matter. As long as the narrative is there, as long as people continue to believe that SWE is going to flip Solana, or Sui is just straight up better than Solana, it doesn't matter. We're all in here to make money. At least that should be the number one goal. Yes, you can like the tech and all that type of stuff, but if you're not in crypto to make money, then why are you really in here? Because this could be the last super cycle born. And if it is, do you want to be that person that later on in life said, I experienced the last super cycle bull run and I didn't take advantage of all the opportunities that had presented itself because I felt like all these coins was all hype. Now, I'm not trying to say that everyone needs to pour into Sui. I'm not saying you need to be buying Sui right now. I'm mainly talking to the people that just hate on all the coins that have all this attention and all this hype. I mean, meme coins have been making millionaires all year long. So to me, it doesn't matter where the hype is. If the hype is there and I can make money, I want to be there because I want to make some money. You know, and when you take a look back, everybody knows this story. In May of 2010, a programmer made history by spending 10,000 Bitcoins to have two large pizzas delivered at his door. OK, and back then. Bitcoin was nothing but hype. Let, let's just be honest right here. There were some people who actually understood it. And then there were those people who was in it just because it was hype. That's why they bought it. Everything starts off as hype. Now, I'm not comparing Sui to Bitcoin. I'm not trying to say that Sui is the next Bitcoin. But Sui is the next coin that is going to make people a lot of money, in my opinion. And some people want to say, oh, you're becoming a moon boy and all that type of stuff. This has nothing to do with that. I'm all about chasing where the money is flowing. So even though this is a sweet video, at the end of the day, it's based around chasing or being in the place where the money is flowing. That's the thing that matters the most to me. I just want to make the most amount of money as possible, whether it be SWE or whether it be in another coin. I think that, yes, you need to have your long term plays, you know, coins that you strongly believe in. You're in it because the tech is really good and you believe in those coins. There's nothing wrong with that. I have those plays, too, but I also have plays where I'm, you know, the momentum is nice. I feel like the momentum is going to continue. So I want to make sure I can capitalize on all of those gains. There's nothing wrong with that. Now, if we take a look at the charts on Sui, okay, so we're still in this bullish momentum that was fired when September 7th, 
And I've been this, I've been in here just riding this entire wave. And it's looked very, very sweet seeing the way that Sui has been performing. Okay. And I think that this momentum is going to be continuing for a little while. I don't think that, of course, there's going to be pullbacks along the way, but I can't lose because I have free money in this right now because I've already taken out my initial investment. That's the way that I operate. You know, as soon as I double my money, take out my initial investment so that if things were to go south, let's say some jaw dropping news was to happen for Sui, then, you know, the, the most that I can lose is the free money that I made. Now, I'm not sure if I've covered this once before in one of my Sui videos, but I keep seeing this all over the place, how people like to say how they don't like the tokenomics on Sui, how it scares them. And the only thing I have to say about that is, is this your first bull run? Because if you were in the last bull run, then you already know how people operate. People don't care about the tokenomics when there's an insane amount of hype in a coin. I've seen the most like trash tokenomics ever explode in a bull run. And I mean explode because the only thing that matters to most people is, is a coin going to go up? Because I want to hop in if the coin is going to go up. <laughs> I'm telling you guys, that's just the way that it goes, man. As, lo as long as the momentum is there, as long as a coin is going up, people are going to keep pouring into it and ignore the tokenomics. That doesn't matter as much in a bull market. Of course, the better the tokenomics, the better the returns. You, you know, it's going to be epic. The returns are going to be epic. You have great tokenomics and um, great momentum. Oh, geez, that's epic. But regardless, Sui is going to continue to go up because the momentum is there. There is a lot of hype around it, and I can't wait to see how high this thing goes. It's still super far from the market cap of Solana, so we know that it's got a long way to go. But that's what I think. Anyways, again, do your own research. I could always be wrong at the end of the day. Nothing in this video is financial advice, but Sui is one of those coins that I plan on holding for a long time because I think that's going to do fantastic things and it's going to continue to make my portfolio look green. Sui, some of those meme coins, the meme coins are getting extreme attraction, extreme attention right now. So, hey, then they do whatever makes you guys feel comfortable. But that's what I have for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. Check out a few of the links that I have down below. And until next time, take care.